Has YouTube just given all YouTubers a very clear sign about the direction of tags in the future on the platform? A new change to the video edit page could be very important. I'm going to talk about it. Here is a page that everyone who is a video creator will recognise. It's the video edit page. Let's just scroll down past your title, your descriptions, your thumbnails. You'll now notice there's now not a tag box. And you have to go all the way down to show more. Just like on the upload page, you can then scroll down further past paid promotion. And then here's the tags followed by language and upload subtitles and education, which is your category. Now, if you've not been on the platform for long, you, you don't understand the weight, the gravity of this. This is YouTube hiding the tag box underneath the fold. This is YouTube moving away from the title, descriptions, thumbnail and tags method of the past and now it simply reads that tags can be helpful especially for things that happen to be misspelled rather than tags are paramount for growth and reach now what does this mean for me i'm still going to keep using tags it's it's there so i'm going to use it until they entirely remove it does this mean that they've devalued this specific feature Possibly. Does this now mean that their YouTube algorithm is going to be focusing much more on the title, descriptions, the thumbnail, the click-through rate, and quality watch time? Yes. Does this mean the death of optimization tools? In my opinion, no. I've been using the vidIQ app since February, March this year, and I use it for more than just tags. I use it to help me optimize my thumbnails. I use it to engage with my audience. I use it for bulk editing actions. I get to compare my thumbnail against other rivals. It helps me translate my videos and things like that. So the tools that you use for browser place plugins, they may need to move away from tags in the long term. But if YouTube's turned into a more AI smart driven based system, maybe the other tools need to adapt as well. But I'm quite curious. I'm also quite excited. If you're excited, smash that like button. Here is another big change to the YouTube platform. Another big change to the YouTube algorithm. And also, it's October and yet another change that this may have been the thing that caused the PewDiePie issues previously the other weekend. There's a, a video that I discussed it vaguely up here. I told you that there was changing something. But what do you feel about this? Do you feel that this could hamper you? Do you think that tags were dead anyway? Or do you think this is the clear sign now that YouTube's buried them and this is the graveyard that they should have died in. If you want further help engaging your audience and writing correct titles and keeping them watching for longer, I've done a whole playlist here which will now help you to escape from the tags that you may have been relying on.